Hey everyone, be sure to drop a like. It seems like the market is finally recovering and we're gonna be seeing massive uptrades for Shiba Inu. So it's up 20% right now and there's some big news that you need to hear. It's about the Bitcoin ban and Bitcoin has finally seen its green day going back to 34k. You know, big institutions are buying back into this. After a big dip, we actually have good news, which everyone is happy about. Dogecoin being up 34%, but still being, you know, 23% down last week. We can see Solana going up 40%. So all of these coins are having massive price bumps from yesterday's price drop. So a lot of these coins are going to be growing in the future. A lot of these coins are having big rebounds. And Shiba Inu is actually doing pretty well as well. If we check over here, it's up 20%. And we can see it's still on rank 30. So what exactly is happening? Well, it's very simple. SEC delays decision on Valkyrie Bitcoin ETF. Valkyrie digital asset file with its SEC for listing its Bitcoin ETF on the New York Stock Exchange in January. And there's also another thing. So the SEC delayed basically means that Bitcoin is not going to be banned so far. Exchange Commission has postponed its decision on whether to approve a Bitcoin exchange traded fund. And this would be huge. This would be one of the biggest traded funds ever. The SEC has delayed its decision on Bitcoin ETF filing by Texas-based family investment fund Valkyrie Digital Assets. And Texas is all for crypto right now. They are accepting crypto far and wide. After receiving comments on the proposed rule changing regarding the new fund. According to official Tuesday filing by the SEC, the commission has found it was appropriate to designate a longer period to take action on the proposed rule change regarding the Bitcoin ETF. So, Basically, they want to crack down on the funds. The SEC is here to just, you know, regulate, to see if crypto is real or not, to see if it's a scam. And Valkyrie initially filed its application for Valk Valkyrie Bitcoin Trust on the New York Stock Exchange this January. So that's when the price started dropping. The SEC noted that it has received comments on the fund that were published in May 2021. The authority said it's extending the review period for the ETF by 45 days, rescheduling the decision for August 10th. And August 10th, we're going to be hearing massive news. The new regulatory delay comes shortly after the SEC delayed approval for another major Bitcoin ETF, extending the last week the review period for Van Isiki's Bitcoin Trust for a second time this year. The regulator said the SEC was seeking additional public comments over a 45 Five day period. So what exactly does this mean to the normal reader? Well, they're still looking into things, you know, if they want to allow crypto or not. But Van Essiki Associate said that approval may only be a matter of time, get a huge demand for Bitcoin in the United States. And if Bitcoin gets accepted in the United States, it's already getting accepted in Texas. Who knows how much the price uh, actually spike would be. So the executive has also suggested that the latest delay could not be the last. They don't really need to make a decision in August. It's sort of an artificial deadline as the one was last week. The SEC is just not moving fast on this, he said, and they're taking it very slow with crypto. And that's good news. That's what made it go up 20%. And it's very obvious here, you know, that they still haven't decided what to do. But if you don't know who SEC is, it's Securities and Exchange Commission for the US. And if this gets banned, if Bitcoin gets banned, that's going to be terrible. But holders actually see opportunity Bitcoin price crash that happened. And now they're, you know, paying it off and believes that the current Bitcoin price drop is a correction and it's wetting out the paper hands. And also what's happening, you know, also the bad coins are going away. So we could see, you know, a girl here just chilling, you know, everything price crashing, everything is dropping. But the downward trend in Bitcoin price falling its April all time high might be worrying for first time investors. And for all you ship holders out there that are holding strong right now, this is really good news. Still, CoinShares chief strategy officer Meltem Demeanors believes that most of the long time holders are not selling. And this is a correction to weed out the panic sellers. So you really need to watch out if you're going to be, you know, considering selling your coins before Shiba Swap, before Coinbase, before all of these big listings things like Robin Hood before a major partnerships and if you want to do it if you need the money that's completely fine speaking to CNBC uh, Bitcoin is here to stay and after 200 days of the crypto market expansion it's normal to have a price drop you can't have a number go up forever she added stating what we're seeing is a correction a, con a contraction and a lot of what is getting shaken out is what we call the paper hands the weak hands so you know the weak hands are selling the new investors Paper hands is a popular term market to describe an investor who can't endure financial risk. So those who have diamond hands 
are not selling Shiba Inu right now, but those who have paper hands are massively selling. Reminding that the crypto market, excluding Bitcoin, is up 200% for the year. Darren Moore said that Bitcoin has always been a volatile asset class. I'm not going to go anywhere even if we go to 20000 last March. We were at 3000 for Bitcoin, she said, adding that we have to keep context in mind. So Bitcoin is still up and I think the future of crypto is looking pretty nicely. She said that many retail investors who didn't do the research are selling while long-term holders continue to wait. If we look on chain activity, wallets have been holding for a long time that have actually been using this opportunity to accumulate, she added. And Glassdoor confirmed the miners' points according to its data. Bitcoin addresses that do not sell the high coins, they accumulate, have increased the holding. So the richers get rich because they keep buying. And same is happening for Shiba Inu. Uh, the whales are actually buying, the paper hands are selling. So... The rich will get richer, obviously. Meanwhile, Bitcoin is heading for its worst quarter, and we obviously saw the big price increase right now. So this is going to be good. Bitcoin is down, but it's going back up slowly. And in the future, we don't know when the big spike will be. But I don't think you even need articles to see here that Shiba Inu has grown about 40,000 members. We just got to check the analytics so far, and we can clearly see that more and more holders are coming into this. We can see, you know, everything is stable. Well, there's just more people here than ever before looking for Shiba Inu and actually going into that. So 550,000 horrors probably by the time the video is out. And I'm really excited about this one because there's some massive marketing. But the Bridgeport Connecticut now on the map with a serious Shiba billboard made by day. And Shiba Army, the stop Connecticut, next stop moon, shibatoken.com. And this is for real. This is I don't think this is photoshopped, but someone actually, you know, bought up a billboard. Marketing has been starting, you know, it's been completely funded by the community for the community. And as we see these dips, that's not a bad thing. You know, this is going to be short term. In one year from now, this channel is not even going to be mentioning dips. This channel is going to be mentioning the moon. And that's what I want. And people, you know, are making memes. People are really excited. But it seems like the ones that buy, you know, if even we reach one cent, that means a lot of investors who are holding $1,000 in ship right now could be millionaires. Yes, they could be millionaires easily. And that's the most important thing because we're getting massive adoption now. I think one set is possible. All it needs is 25 trillion uh, market cap. So I'm excited to announce that the first cryptocurrency is in the work across industry is actually it would need 3 trillion market cap, not 25. But uh, we're seeing, you know, the first motocross industry Shiba Inu acceptance. And the adoption is getting bigger and bigger. Everyone is super happy. Going into an in person developer conference tomorrow, we'll be doing my part of marketing. So everyone knows what they're up to. Everyone is buying and people are actually investing for their kids, for their grandchildren. And that's the beauty of it. You know, this market crashes, this big, big explosions that we're seeing, they're all temporary. What's really good is we're getting Shiba Swap. We're getting all of these big updates that will change the future of Shiba Inu forever. Be sure to drop a like and see you till next time. Peace, everyone.